Hey everyone, my name is Ashley from PodPros, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to design podcast artwork in Canva in less than five minutes. So the first thing that you want to do is click the link in the description, and that's going to bring you to the Canva website, and you can sign up for a free account. It's completely free, and you can always upgrade to Pro, but you're, you don't need Pro to do anything that we're going to be doing, um, and we're going to be designing some podcast artwork. So let's just say I am going to say I have a podcast about about like corona the, the coronavirus spreading information about it so we'll just call it like corona care or something like that um this is just a fictional podcast but we're going to click up here and we need to go scroll down and press custom dimensions because the dimensions or basically how big the podcast artwork is is 1500 x 1500 you see all of these have different dimensions because they're all different sizes so we need 1500 by 1500 and make sure it's on pixels it will be on pixels for default and we're just going to press create new design and so now we have our design and we're just going to title it corona care and since we're trying to do this in less than five minutes, I'll just show you basically what Canva is about. So we have templates in this screen, uploads, these are images that will upload. These are different photos, but I don't really recommend using like photos in podcast art. Um, I recommend using more like elements really, text, music, we don't need music, we don't need videos, and background is just different backgrounds and folders so basically what i want to do is create some artwork for um the corona care podcast so first i'm going to go in backgrounds and i'm just going to try to find a background that i like um we'll just start with this one first and we, we can always we can always change it later but this is just going to be our background for now and now we're going to go into elements actually i like this background oh that's pro See, when you um, go over an image, it should show you if it's free or paid. It's saying it's free, so I don't know why it's showing the Canva. But we'll, we'll just use the one that we had used before, which is this one. So now let's go to elements, and we're going to try to find some elements related to the coronavirus. So... We could try to find some that are relevant. Luckily, we, there are a lot that are relevant because the coronavirus is something that's still going on. So if we want to bring something in, we can just click on it and it's going to be brought in and we can play with the handles to make it bigger or smaller. Um, I don't really like that one actually. Um, We could use this one of like a girl with like a mask. And now we just want some text at the top. So cool, the cool thing about text is that they already have a whole bunch of different presets. So we can just use something like this and call it Corona Care. And if you want to change, let's make it all in one line. And if you want to change the font, it's up here. Change the 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 height, the width. We'll just move it around and see now the the colors don't really match. This color doesn't really match that. Um, I'm going to change it to glow and put Corona care. And I'm just going to make it about 250. And I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller again. So 225. And it still doesn't really match. 
So I'm going to go into elements and try to find one that I think matches a little bit more. This one matches a little bit more. See the pink kind of matches this more. Um, the document colors, what's really cool is it'll pull colors from the document. So basically it pulls like the white from the brick and it pulls like this is her skin color. So I think that's really cool. So if we can change it to this, which is the color of what she's wearing, it kind of changes it. it. Yeah, you see it matches a lot more now. So I actually really like how this looks. I think it's really simple. The only thing that I'm not really vibing with is the background, so maybe we can try to change the background into something that... I like this. This looks really nice. Yeah, I, I like this a lot more. So, I just designed some podcast artwork in less than five minutes. If you design your podcast artwork in Canva and you're not, you're still not satisfied with it, I actually design podcast artwork professionally. I don't do it in Canva, I do it in Photoshop. Basically how it works is you send me an email saying that you want some podcast artwork. Um, I usually charge $100, but it's going to be 50% off for a limited time because of the coronavirus. And basically, then I send you a questionnaire that you can fill out so I can have a little bit more information about your podcast. So basically, after that, then I get right to work designing three to five designs um, and different iterations of the podcast artwork. I send it to you and you either pick one of those that you want to purchase or you tell me what you do and you don't like and I'll get right to work designing three to five more designs. So basically it's an unlimited rounds until I get your podcast artwork perfect and you don't pay until you're satisfied. And it's basically, I just send you an invoice through PayPal and you don't even need to have a PayPal account. It's just so that the transaction is secure. So that's basically the whole process. And it's really simple, really fast. And you can get some professional podcast artwork done. And again, I don't design it using Canva, I design it in Photoshop. So if you're interested in that, there's more info in the description. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, please remember to leave a like and subscribe. And this is a new series on my channel and in the next episode in this new series, I'm gonna be designing in a different online um, editor. So anyways, I'll see you in the next video and this has been Ashley from Pod Pros.